more. Ooh, cherry blossom's very pretty. Uh, um, and the cherry blossom, if you don't know, um, is the ancient Japanese symbol for a basic bitch. So. <laughs> Namaste. Uh, <laughs> I'm also trying really hard um, to stop drinking. I'm going to AA for a little bit. Um, it's boring. I'm bored. Um, <laughs> I don't like it. Um, it's terrible. And also, I think I did worse things when I was sober. I once had sex with a magician on purpose. <laughs> he filled my vagina with rabbits. <laughs> I didn't hate it. Uh, <laughs> also, the guy who's like in charge of the like meeting, like the, the big man, he came up to me afterwards and was like, whatever the darkness inside of you, somebody loves you. And I was like, first of all, of course they do. I'm adorable. <laughs> but that does not stop me wanting to guzzle a bag of cocaine and have sex with someone who looks a bit too much like my uncle. <laughs> not let them circa 94, you're welcome. Uh, I have a lot of incest dreams. <laughs> Incest dreams make people very uncomfortable, make very sad, but actually they're fine. Um, I looked it up on a um, Christian dream analysis website. <laughs> which is where I get all of my life advice. No, stop it, you're actually being very aggressive and quite sexual. <laughs> they were very clear, they were like, um, incest dreams basically mean there's a relationship within your family um, that you feel that needs working on, which is so nice. Oh, like so nice when you think about it in those... <laughs> Good to see you again, Cousin Barrel. Um, but it's so nice to think of it in that way because I have them all the time about like my dad and my very sexy brother. Um, but I never have them about my mum, and my mum is my best friend. She sends me nudes. Um, she's a <laughs> but she's a working class woman from Cornwall, so they're very much like, here is my naked body, what do you think? <laughs> like, is it a threat? I don't know. <laughs> Does she know I'm coming for him? <laughs>